Intention is a very powerful word to use when you're asking for energy healing, for medical intuition, for intuition, or for spiritual purposes. But here's what you need to do when you're asking and making requests from the universe. Number one, if you say, well, I'm trying to do this. Trying is a never, never land. Trying is for let's try on shoes, let's try different recipes, let's try different restaurants. It's still like all over everything. And if I say, I'll try to be to dinner Friday night, do you think I'm gonna show up? Probably not. And a lot of people say, well, it's my intention to do this. Intention is all over the place. That means you're thinking about it, all right? So if you're asking for healing energy, spirit information, guidance, intuition, clairvoyant, clairaudient, anything like that, or you're giving a command, you say, I intend, like I intend to do 50 push-ups, 300 sit-ups, and don't ever eat chocolate. And if that's the case, I'll be in good shape because that's what I'm going to do. If you say, it is my intent to meet you at the gym tomorrow, you can bet I'll be there. So when you're making specific spiritual requests and you're making requests for energy healing or intuitive knowing or talking to your guys or anything like that, first of all, be very specific and say, I intend to send healing energy through the nerves and regenerate the neural pathways. It is my intent to physically heal you. It is my intent to talk to Jose, the spirit guide, okay? So by using intent and intend, you're telling the universe and the other side that you mean right now, it's happening, rather than, well, it's my intention when we get around to it, or I'll try sometime whenever, I don't know quite quite, but okay. So hope that helps. Use it is my intent. Be very specific what you're saying your intent is because it works. And I intend. And all of that is very focused, very in the present, and you'll get results. Thanks for listening. Bye-bye-bye.